Every corner of the land beneath this blue sky is ours for the taking. Hi and welcome to Select 10. If you feel like you have watched all the good shows on Netflix, think again. Besides the already popular shows that have caught media attention, there are lots of shows hidden under the Netflix vast library, the shows you've probably never heard of. However, to make things easy for you, we have selected 10 best hidden gems, which you should watch now. And watch full video to avoid missing any series from this list. On number 10. Sense8. It is a science fiction drama series, created by Lana and Lily Wachowski, the directors of the Matrix Reloaded movie. The story follows, eight strangers across the globe, from all different walks of life, are psychically and emotionally connected, after the death of a mysterious woman, named Angelica. While these eight people learn about one another and figure out just what is going on, a stranger named Whispers hunts them down and intent on destroying them. Overall, the show has all of the elements of a good sci-fi drama, intrigue, political unrest, people with superhuman powers, and a terrifying splinter organization. But it is also one of the sexiest shows on Netflix that takes the connection to new levels. And the show has 8.3 rating on IMDb, an 86% critic score, on Rotten Tomatoes. On number 9. I am not okay with this. Yeah, I guess. Oh god. It is a teen superhero series, based on the comic book of the same name. The story follows, Sydney Novak, a 17-year-old teenage girl, living with her mother and younger brother, a year after the death of her father, while navigating the complexities of high school, family, her budding sexuality, and mysterious superpowers, just beginning to awaken deep within her. The series explores young adult relationships, the confusion of puberty, and moving away from old friends as adult life takes over. The show has dark comedy, paired so well with the superhero aspects that makes the story intriguing and interesting to follow. Although the sad thing is, the show was cancelled after one season due to pandemic situation. However if you are a fan of Stranger Things series, then you should check this out. The show has 7.5 rating on IMDb, an 86% critic score, on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 8. Santa Clarita Diet. Not all zombie shows have to be scary, and this zombie comedy series proves that you can add humor into the whole Walking Dead thing. This horror comedy series centers around Joel and Sheila Hammond, who are regular real estate agents living in the suburbs, except for one teeny tiny detail, Sheila is a flesh-eating zombie, unknown to her family, friends, and overly nosy neighbors. Sheila calls her new diet of human flesh as Santa Clarita diet, and her husband, Joel is tasked with hiding her kills until they can figure out what's wrong with her and find a cure. If you like over-the-top comedy, then you'll definitely enjoy this. And the show has 7.9 rating on IMDb, an 89% critic score, on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 7. The OA. It is a mystery drama series, with science fiction, supernatural, and fantasy elements. The show was created by Britt Marling, that ended prematurely, getting cancelled after season 2, with an intense cliffhanger. It's a major loss, as The OA is a strange and inspiring show, unlike anything else on television. The series stars Marling as Prairie Johnson, a woman who reappears after having been missing for seven years. While before she was blind as a result of an accident in her childhood, but now Prairie has somehow regained her sight and returned to her family as thoroughly changed person. Things only get strange where she mentors a group of rowdy teenagers by telling them her story and asking for help in saving other missing people who she claims are trapped in another dimension. Overall, the OA was a wild ride, alternating between silly and brilliance in nearly equal measure, but it was clearly something, and that was made it so bingeable. And the show has 7.9 rating on IMDb, an 84% critic score, on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 6. A Series of Unfortunate Events. It is a mystery drama series, based on Lemony Snicket, children novel series, of the same name. The series follows the tragic tale of three orphans, Violet, Klaus, and Sonny Baudelaire, after their parents' mysterious death and their home destroyed. But when they are placed in the care of their distant relative, Count Olaf, who is determined to claim the family fortune for himself. Following Olaf's failed attempt 
and his plot being exposed, the Baudelaires are placed in the custody of unsympathetic guardians as they try to elude Olaf and his followers and uncover the mystery behind a secret society from their parents' past. Overall, the series is brilliant and visually spectacular and a must-watch for fantasy and mystery drama fans. And the series has 7.6 rating on IMDb and 96% critic score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 5. Godless. It is a western drama miniseries directed by Scott Frank. The series is set in 1884 and centers on notorious criminal Frank Griffin and his gang of outlaws who are on a mission to get revenge on Roy Good, a former protege who betrayed the Brotherhood. To hide from Frank, Roy, a wounded outlaw, winds up in a small mining town in New Mexico, populated almost entirely by women. But when word reaches, Griffin is headed there and the residents of the town band together to defend against his murderous gang. The story is very violent, very western, and is like a breath of fresh air. Overall, Godless is a grim and visually stunning series which deserves your time. And the show has 8.3 rating on IMDb and 85% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 4. Arth Dahl Chronicles. It is a Korean historical series set in a mythical land called Arth, where the inhabitants of the ancient city of Arthdal maintain with power struggles while some encounter love along the way. And the main story follows Yoon Seum as he goes through hardships to bring his tribe back to life and learns of his true origins in the process. Overall, the series depicts the birth of civilization and nations in ancient times and explore the story of mythical heroes, their struggle, unity, and love of people living in a land called Arth. And I can say that many of the people might not have heard about this show, but believe me, it is one of the best ancient drama on Netflix. And the series has 8.5 rating on IMDb and 96% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 3. The Umbrella Academy. Based on the comic book of the same name, it is a superhero series created by Steve Blackman. The series begins when one day, in 1989, 43 babies are inexplicably born to random and unconnected women's who showed no signs of pregnancy until labor began, whereas seven babies are adopted by billionaire industrialist Sir Reginald Hargreaves, who creates the Umbrella Academy and prepares his children to save the world. But in their teenage years, though, the family fractures and the team disbands. But later in future, when the six surviving members of the clan reunite, upon the news of Hargrove's passing, they work together to solve a mystery surrounding their father's death and the threat of an imminent apocalypse. The show is brilliant, but sad thing is that still many people have not seen it yet. And the show has 8 rating on IMDb and 87% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 2. Marco Polo. It is an epic period drama inspired by Marco Polo's early years in the court of Kublai Khan, the Kagan of the Mongol Empire and the founder of the Yuan Dynasty, 1271-1368. This most expensive show of Netflix, somehow it didn't make it to the big audience it deserved. The series tells the grand story of Marco Polo, the explorer, and the years he spent with the Mongols, going back forth in their ranks between prisoner and leader. It was during this crucial time for the empire that Kublai Khan had extended the reach of his empire even further than his more famous grandfather, Genghis Khan. As you'd expect, with a show featuring this many characters and such a new world, the first season is little slow, but the show becomes its full self as a true epic in season 2. The show has mind-boggling visuals and great battle scenes, which keeps you hooked throughout the two seasons. And the show has 8 rating on IMDb and 93% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 1. Dark. It is a German science fiction thriller series co-created by Janch Fries. The story begins in 2019 but later grows to include 1986 and 1953 via time travel when members of the four families become aware of a wormhole in the cave system beneath the local nuclear power plant. But their secrets are revealed concerning connections between four estranged families about a sinister time travel conspiracy which spans several generations and their lives begin crumbling as their ties are exposed. The conspiracy involves the missing children and the history of the town and its citizens. Overall, Dark is Dark, both thematically, visually, which explores secrets, murder, lies and time travel mysteries. And the show has 8.8 .8 rating on IMDb and 95% critic score on Rotten Tomatoes.
And believe me, you don't want to miss this show. In case you don't know, Dark is rated best 56th show of 21st century. And if you have not watched this show yet, then I suggest you to start watching now, it is the greatest show that stays in your mind for a very long time. That's it for today, thank you for watching this video. And do subscribe our channel to see more videos related to movies and series suggestions.